Hey yeah. everybody, <laughs> welcome to the drive back. It's Nick, Taryn. <laughs> we are joined by my brother Isaac in the back. Uh, Isaac's who? waving. Oh, my brother Isaac. Who? You know? We just watched Get Out, um, directed by Jordan Peele. You know him from Key and Peele. And you, you know, when I first heard about this movie that he was directing a horror movie, I'm sitting there going, this is what he's chosen to do after doing the success that they had with Key and Peele and that they were just hitting their stride. I now know and can say without a right, reasonable doubt that he made the right move. Yeah, yeah that yeah. was that was very fantastic. Whoa. Very good. But Whoa. Wait, they, they call that a horror film? That's a, I was okay, I so, feel it's, like more, so it, yeah. it's it's horror psychological yeah. a lot more psychological thriller than yeah. horror. Yeah. Um not really many jump scares per se. Just a lot of just tension and drop like just the building of it through the whole movie. It's a it's a fantastically well crafted story. From just from the story point to the the music, the camera work, like all around, just wow. Like I'm just impressed. It's like good to film. So it's about a young Racism. man. Young, well, there, there there's tons we'll of that. To that. So there's a young man named Chris. He's black, and he's dating a girl, and the girl wants to take him home to visit his family, um, and. S so he's from. They're from the city. So they're going into the countryside to visit the family, and there's a big uh, gathering that's going on at their house. Soiree. Soiree. They white. Get the <laughs> white upper class people. Rich. You know. Those rich white folks. Yes. So yes, going to visit the family, heading out to the middle of nowhere, isolated and alone, and that's about all I'm going to tell you. Now, uh, Taryn, your thoughts? Okay, like. We all knew that this movie had a bit of controversy going into it. Right. Um, I will say that I, I myself was worried, like, oh, great. This is just going to be, you know, an hour and a half to two hours worth of just crapping on white people. No. No, no, no. No. This is masterfully crafted. But it's so smart. And it's so well put together. And it's from beginning to end. And especially once we get into like the real beef of the film, the real meat of it, you're, you're sitting there tense the entire time and you yourself are screaming, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, yeah, get out, get out. Kind of knew it was coming, but it was still able right. to like tease you like, is it really? Mm -hmm. But it, there is certainly a point in the film where you're like, oh, this is definitely. Without any more spoilers, yes. Um, great film, mm -hmm. definitely go watch it. Um, if, <laughs> so I'll, I'll put it, to put some ideas around it. So yes, rated R. Still some gore, still some stuff yeah, there. No, not, not the film for your kids. Not the no, film no. for your kids. No, no. I highly recommend it if you're a film fan, if you're, uh, a f if you, just to see what Jordan Peele has done, like, and see just yes. how how talented he really is as a filmmaker. Good gosh, and like, you can see now, like, now I'm like, okay, when's the next Jordan Peele movie coming yeah. out? So oh, yeah, like that that will be a very easy sell. Definitely for me. a good start to. Filmmaking career for mm -hmm. him. It's of no consequence to the overall review, but it was really good seeing a movie have a Windows Phone featured in it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and it also acted as a plot point because, uh, you know, his phone keeps getting disconnected. We can cut this if it's too mm -hmm. spoilery. His phone keeps getting disconnected. I'm like, there's no other person in that house that has a Windows Phone. And that cable <laughs> does not need, need to be used for anything else. No, like, this is intentional. So, Isaac, thumbs up, thumbs down? Oh, if I had a third arm, three thumbs up. Yeah, yeah two, two thumbs up, definitely. It is, definitely uh, It really, a it's wonderful, very, wonderful it, movie. it had tones of like Hitchcock, definitely, with that psychological stuff. My gosh, yeah, it's so good. Like, um, we're, we're probably gonna get done with this review and continue talking about the right, film. Because we can't go into any further details because we don't spoil it for you yeah. at home. Thumbs up, highly recommend, go watch in theaters. Yeah. Like if you're, if you're just into the uh, concept of a really well done horror suspense thriller. It has you on the edge of your seat yeah. pretty much from the like, second act on and you're not sure what's gonna happen. Yeah. So definitely highly recommend. Thanks for checking us out. Uh, hopefully we'll have more coming next week. Um, I'm Nick. That's Taryn. That's Isaac in the back. We'll catch you next time. Later. Peace.